Hi Sagittarius and welcome to my channel. I hope you're doing well. Thank you so much for your support on my channel, for your likes, comments, subscribes and donations. It really means a lot and welcome if you're new. So for this reading I'm going to focus on you and your person's energy. This is for those of you in separation from your person, it could be your soulmate or twin flame. So I'm going to check in on your energies. Take what resonates and leave the rest, remember it's general, feel free to flip the energies, they can come out reversed. And although this is dated August 2022, my readings are timeless, so it could resonate whenever you come across this reading. Okay, so I was seeing a butterfly, symbol of the butterfly, before this reading, um, symbol of spirituality, transformation for some of you in your lives, new beginning maybe. Um, I'm going to also pull a spirit animal card, not just for the message, but you might see some of these animals after this reading and that could be a sign for you. see quite abundant um, symbol of abundance actually symbol of the mother um, feminine energy and the message the miracles are endless so believe that okay some of you do have some miracles happening behind the scenes you've got the feather there you might be seeing feathers as a sign from your guides we've also got the horse Freedom is yours. Some of you have felt trapped. You want to free yourself from a situation. You have the strength to do this. 33 has come out there, master number. So this could have been some lessons that you've been through here and your lesson now is to break free from whatever this is, you know, job, relationship, thoughts, behaviors, addictions. Some of you could have been born in the year of the horse. And um, we've got hawk spirit, let spirit be your guide. So again, with the feathers, you might be seeing feathers as a sign that could give you some clues, direction. The hawk sees things from a higher perspective, sets its sights, you know, on prey, let's say. Um, but I'm seeing for you, it's like your goals. We've also got 32, 33, transition. There's also a dove here, beautiful, bottom of the deck, symbol of peace, love and hope. Um, so again, feathers coming through, maybe white feathers in particular that you see. It's interesting, I, I saw one in my backyard, um, I think it was yesterday, and it's still out there, white feather. So, you know, you see how even if you don't go out, you know, you still get the signs in some way. <laughs> so look out for them, Sagittarius. Okay, so let's tune in then to your energy, Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Um, also, 33 breaks down to a 6 and 15 breaks down to a 6. Um, speaking about harmony, finding peace, like the dove there, in your life. Okay, so it's interesting I said about lessons and we've got the Hierophant. 
which speaks about spiritual lessons. And for some of you, as a result, you're going through this transformation. That's interesting I said about the butterfly in my vision. Um, dark night of the soul, maybe, or an ending of something here, maybe a marriage or a relationship. Um, but I'm getting for some of you, it's uh, a result of reflecting, going really deep here, taking off the mask. So spiritual awakening coming through. Um, slaying those demons, I really feel here. Something that, yeah, has kept you trapped. It's interesting we had freedom come out there. And, you know, the bird here is free as well. Um, certainly, yeah, filling your own cup, loving yourself, putting yourself first. And with a chariot, I'm seeing alignment, victory, success, moving forward, travel for some of you. Um, three major arcana, definitely highlighting spiritual lessons, as I felt. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Taurus. You might have those in your chart. Yeah, I'm, I'm really feeling water for some of you in your chart. Um, not for all of you. So let's have a look. Um, no, sorry. They're telling me to, to clarify. Um, Hierophant here. Yeah, it could well have been a relationship here that's come to an end. Um, some communication, you know, something you wanted to say. The light was shed on a particular area, you know, on a belief. Maybe you had different beliefs. Um, and for some of you, it's just you looking within, you know, shining the light on your own internal beliefs, feeling better in yourself. I'm really getting therapy coming through here. Some of you might have had a sort of aha moment in therapy recently. Um, so we've got Leo, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. So let's see the chariot then. It's definitely something, yeah, you, you free yourself. So even here, you've got this freedom coming through. Something, it's like you, you just feel content, more content, less confused. Yeah, um, new beginning here, passionate new beginning, even with the page of wands, communication that helps you set, set yourself free and start again. You might have just had a lot on and needed a bit of guidance. Um, something new, some of you are starting there. I feel, yeah, Queen of Pentacles. Um, new job, maybe, that comes in, or something you're starting, new project. Um, Could even be a person, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo there. You're being guided to be patient. I'm actually sensing this rushed energy at the moment in your energy. Um, impatience, yeah. They're telling me to slow down, it's coming through in me. <laughs> You got the tower, yeah. Something here clearly that crumbles, wasn't built on solid ground. Um, 
you need to be quite strong during this time. But I feel it helps you to start whatever this is, this new venture. Um, this all happens for a reason. It may not feel like it at the time. Okay, let's have a look at your person then. Okay, yeah, see I'm getting a slower energy now. <laughs> That's interesting. They could be an earth sign. Yeah, it's interesting that card flipped over, flipped back, spirit saying yes. Earth sign for some of you, which came out there. Um, I thought the card flipped over there, but... Oh yeah, there it is. Okay, Knight of Swords, which is here. Communication potentially on the way, because um, that's the same person, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, and it's quite fast, well, very fast, actually. So that's maybe where I was feeling that speeding up. Wow, then we've got the Ace of Wands, again. A lot of passion between you and this person could make you very happy. Strength card again. Um, always interesting when we get repeat cards, I see it as mirroring or this is in the energy. You know, I'm feeling this is actually in the energy. Um, yeah, and there's also mirroring, though, they're telling me, yeah. It's like... Your person here also has to release something. Um, they need to heal from this and be strong. Now, for some of them it's an addiction. Something they were very obsessed with, they're telling me. This comes to an end, though. They complete the chapter successfully. Could be a relationship, um, could be a job, something they need to get off their chest here. Um, Aquarius, Leo, Capricorn come out there. Let's see a bit more about this Knight of Wands. Yeah, wow, so becoming single, um, whether that's leaving a job, starting to work on their own for themselves, you know, or leaving a relationship, becoming single wanting more balance in their life. So let's have a look at the world. You know, there's a loss there. Yeah, see the same card, page of wands to come out for you. Um, so, yeah, again, mirroring. It's like you're both going through something similar here. You'll know what it is. Um, I feel for some of you, it's standing strong, speaking your truth, um, defending yourself, freeing yourself, and starting again. You've both got an ace. There's an ace here as well, okay. Something your person starts on their own here, I feel. Project, new job. Okay. 
Yeah, there's there's an energy here of deception coming through in this person, well, around this person, I should say. Could be your person. Um, so again, it was either at work, something they're on toward, or a relationship, and someone stepped out. Yeah, there's like some mistrust. Your person has felt very burdened in this situation. So maybe the person was very controlling. Um, felt the need to sneak around because this other energy was spying on them, said controlling. Your person ends that chapter feels very heavy and I'm feeling a lot of guilt come through in someone whether it's your person or this other energy there well so we'll leave that there because it's quite complex when we've got like three energies let's get some more for you Sagittarius and um, as I said at the moment I'm just feeling you're both ending a chapter here starting a new one so there's not really much movement between you both. Yeah, see so Spirit saying in divine timing, um, things will shift. Wow, you got the seven of swords. Two sevens, so that's three sevens there. Um, Some of you are going to be reflecting a lot when you go through this shift and free yourself. Maybe someone deceived you. Or maybe you were deceiving yourself there. Could even be this person deceived you. Um, yeah, and again, you just want to break free. I can feel it in my energy. It feels very heavy for some of you as well. Uh, wow, this is quite a heavy reading. It won't resonate for all of you. Um, but just taking that leap. There's the sun in the background. Bright new beginning. Learning from what you've been through. It's coming through there. Um, yeah, because we had the Hierophant, of course, with the lessons. Okay, let's just pull some letters now to finish then. Sagittarius. We might get initials or a word. So we've got G, T, K, W, B, a, Z, it's got Baz, K, L, L, S, E, N, R, and A. I'm also saying ran, and it's interesting in this card, this person's running, sneaking away. So that could be what your person did. And that's what you're thinking about there. Uh, we've got Cal. Ban. B-A-N. So maybe you've blocked this person or they blocked you. Yeah, because we've got wall coming up. So, you know, it's good to put boundaries in place. I feel that's what some of you need to do, but not a wall where you're completely shutting yourself off. Um, Bake. So 
some of you might enjoy baking, a uh, baker. Now it could be someone's job, but also a surname there. Laker as well. I believe that's, excuse me for my ignorance in sport, but I believe there's a Lakers team. Let me know in the comments. That's just coming through there. Someone's a fan. Um, they're telling me. I can see it. I think it's yellow. Well, I'm seeing someone wearing a yellow vest with blue outline. Now, I don't know if that's that team, but that's a team that's coming through. So someone's a sports fan. Um, also, Lake. So you might live near a lake, or they might. Um, taker, that's quite interesting. So, you know, again, they might have just taken what they could and ran. It's really coming through, actually. Um, but I feel this is happening to them, this karma here happening. Okay, this lesson that they have to go through. Okay, Sagittarius, I'll leave it there. Hope you've enjoyed this reading. Um, please do comment, you know, hit the like button if so. Sending lots of love to you all.